Have you ever noticed that if you train for a couple of months, then had a break, started again with the training, that your muscle will come back after that immediately? Or like in a really short time? This is not just a perception of yours. This is a phenomena called muscle memory. And muscle memory is real. Today I explain to you how muscle memory works, but why you should never stop training in the first place. Hint, it's because your body is a bitch. Let's explain one aspect of muscle memory by telling a story about our favorite president. Donald Trump has built and lost successful businesses in his lifetime. At one time, he was a couple billions of dollars in personal debt. Now, if I would be in that debt, I probably would spend the rest of my lifetime working as a human slave for an angry creditor of mine, or just jump in front of the train. But Donald Trump managed to get back on his feet after his loss and is now worth a couple billion dollars again. This is simply because Donald Trump knows what it takes to make money. He knows how much work it is. He's got the network and street credibility. Yo, the same thing happens to your body when you're training again after a short break. Your body already knows that stuff. It's easier to build a successful business after you've already built 10 in the past. Naturally, it's easier to achieve a Greek body after you've already achieved a Greek body in the past. Because you simply know whatever it freaking takes. Your body is a learning machine. On a biological level, a reason might be that resistance training adds, next to contractile elements, new nuclei to your muscles. Nuclei is the plural for nucleus, which stands for the central part of a cell, containing the genetic material. This is like the controlling element. Now when you stop the training, your body doesn't recycle the entire muscle group in your organism. New research shows that your body keeps the nuclei and loses the contractile elements. Maybe because the nuclei are a bigger investment in the first place. It might be possible that nuclei are more or less permanent once created. But scientists are not completely sure. They estimate the lifespan between 15 years and a human lifetime. This basically means that you could be massive as a teen, stop the workout schedule and then start training as a retired mofo again and build faster muscles than your peers. Awesome if you ask me. Until you realize that your body does the same thing with your fat cells. Your fat cells never really die, they just get emptier. Which means that if you've been overweight as a teen, you're far more likely to be overweight as an adult. This reminds me of a Les Brown quote, do what's hard and your life will be easy. Do what's easy and your life will be hard. Our organism never really forgets. A sunburn can cause skin cancer years later. An accident may lead to joint problems 30 years in the future. Your body can be an incredible ally in helping you create the life that you want, but it also can be a detrimental enemy. So stop doing what is easy. Subscribe to this channel and get your ass to the gym.